By now, you're probably aware that when you type in a web address into a Word document, an email, or on websites like Google Docs, the web address you type turns into a link to that particular URL. But what if you want to include a clickable link in a document without having to leave the entire URL address visible to whomever is viewing the document? What if you want the document to say, click here, or you want people to click on an image rather than text to go to a specific web address? You can do this with a hidden or embedded link. For the Doctor Who fans out there, I'm going to call them TARDIS links because the actual URL is usually much bigger than the text or image you're going to click on. The process for including these hidden links is very similar in many different platforms. In this video, I'll show you how to add the TARDIS link in Microsoft Word 2010, Outlook 2010, and in a Google Drive document. We'll start here in Microsoft Word. I have in this document an image and text I want to turn into a hidden link. We'll start with the text. I highlight the words I want to turn into a link, in this case the word here. Then I right click or control click to bring up the secondary link menu. And from here, I'm going to select the word hyperlink. Then in the address bar, I paste the link I want to add. I'll have already copied this onto the clipboard of my computer, and now I'm going to press control V to paste. Then I click OK. Now I've returned to the document where you can see the word here has turned into a clickable link. To turn an image into a clickable link, I go through the exact same process. I right click or control click on the picture. I select hyperlink from the secondary click menu. Then I paste my link into the address bar and click OK. Now I can share this document either as a Word file or as a PDF and my links will be active for the viewer to click on. Now we'll take a look at adding a TARDIS link into an Outlook email. Same process. First, make sure you have already copied the URL of the link you want to include onto your computer clipboard. Then highlight the text or select the image you want to turn into a hyperlink. Then right click or control click and select hyperlink from the secondary click menu. Paste your link in the address bar and click OK. And there you have it, you have added a hidden link to an email. You can also use this process in pretty much all the Microsoft Office software like PowerPoints and spreadsheets. Finally, we'll take a look at adding one of these links to a Google document. Same exact process again, only with slightly different look and feel. I highlight the text I want, I right click or control click, then I look for the word link instead of hyperlink, and I paste my link and hit apply. And there you have it. You've now successfully added a hidden or TARDIS link into a Microsoft Office document, an Outlook email, and into a Google Doc.